Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Do not be afraid. I'm ma- making this podcast in particular to uh, Japan because uh, I don't know how much this news got has come in Japan, but recently in America and in uh, Tokyo, there certainly has been a movement we now call Occupy. It's also in St Paul's in Finsbury Square in London. The mask I put on there. Uh, I shall put it back just in case you can see it. This fella here, which is the symbol of Guy Fawkes. Remember, remember the 5th of November gunpowder, treason, and plot. I see no reason that treason should ever fe- be forgot. And this is a symbol of it. It may seem rather odd, but what what the people are doing there are reacting to a certain injustice felt by the uh, the recent economic downturn that's been around since two thousand and eight, and the fact that the people who uh, earn mo- least of the money apparently have to pay for it. And that's what the people at St. Paul's in London and in t- a little bit in Tokyo and also most obviously in Wall Street are, p- are protesting about. Most interestingly, since the, uh, the occupation of St. Paul's Cathedral, there actually has been two resignations of two t- church leaders. Which interests me greatly. Anyway, I must confess I myself do support these these interests. Hence the mask. I do feel that they are worthy of content. I don't wear the mask entirely. Though. I would say, as I, as I said before. I feel that their cause is just. They are not. There is at the moment in London a few, quite a few tents camping out St Paul's, and they're doing no one any harm. And yet they've been trying to get rid of all the time. True, St Paul's is lo- lo- losing, so they say, twenty pounds, twenty thousand pounds per day. I'm not thinking about sorry. Yet. As long as they're pe- they're peaceful, as long as their cause is just, as long as they can feel that, as long as they don't do anything bad, I feel I can't really oppose them. And for that, I wear the following. Thank you.